<laughs> uh, just cue me again. <laughs> Welcome, everyone, to the Hearthstone edition of Streamer Showdown, an online game show putting your favorite streamers in a battle of wits. I'm your host for tonight, Garrett Weinzerl. But let's get to know our contestants. Our first contestant is known for uncovering some of the most rare and bizarre interactions in Hearthstone. A man so shrouded in mystery that YouTube thinks he's impersonating himself. The reigning champion of Hearthstone Streamer Showdowns, Disguised Toast. Hello, hello. Uh, excited to be back. I see that we have some really tough competition this time around. So I'm a bit nervous. Oh, are you? Okay. Oh, thanks, Toast. Well, I was talking about Brian. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, that's that's fantastic. Well, uh, speaking of which, also joining us today is a man famous within more than just one card game, the Dragon Master. But I prefer to think of him as Shiro's pet human, Brian Kibler. Hello, I'm uh, you know still recovering from eating too much over Thanksgiving and Thanksgiving weekend, and just had more leftovers this morning, so I'm well energized for this battle. Tur turkey breakfast everyone's favorite oh yeah oh yeah <laughs> well and Shiro final... begged for all of it <laughs> oh that's oh, that's good did, did Shiro get any a little bit a little bit all right all right i can i can hear my uh chihuahuas perking up just at the mention <laughs> of this uh our final contestant he is uh, a beacon of hope for free-to-play players he runs one fine educational stream and he loves wearing t-shirts with his own face on them the mayor of value town trump welcome back speak of the devil that's me. Yes. <laughs> yes. I, I was taking a shot in the dark there. I was like, I'm pretty sure he's going to show up. I have up a much prettier it. face in my shirt. But oh, there you go. There you certainly go. more cut <laughs> Not true. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. So, Brian, <laughs> Trump, I have, to, I have to ask you, is today the day, are, you, are one of you going to finally put a stop to Toast Win Streak? Statistics say no. <laughs> <laughs> Math checks out. We'll see. We'll see. It's an honest answer. I like it. I like it. Well, uh, well, let's explain what's going to be going on today. There's going to be six rounds, each uh, a different game type where the players will accumulate points. When you get answers correct, you gain points. When you get them wrong, sometimes you're going to lose points. Finish with the most points and you will be our streamer showdown winner. Twitch chat will then spam the emote the winner chose before the show in their honor. So you really, you really want to win to get that, uh, to get that Twitch chat spam going, guys. So, uh, before we get started, I want to let all of our viewers know that if you enjoy today's showdown and you'd love to see us do more, you can donate to the tip jar and support the show by going to our Matcharino page, which you can find by going to bit.ly slash showdown18 or click the Matcharino tip jar graphic in the Twitch description below. If you haven't used Matcharino before, it's super simple. You can log in using your Twitch account and donate using PayPal. Also, there are some, uh, there's some cool items where portion of the purchase goes towards the tip jar. So if you like the show, donate over at bit.ly slash showdown18. But let's go ahead and get this show going. Let's start off with round one. Round one. Welcome to Cardology. In this game, each question will consist of a series of hints describing a card. Hints are shown one after the other, and all players will see them at the same time. The first player to buzz in, so hands on the buzzer, and guesses the right, uh, they get the chance to guess the answer. If they're right, they win points. If they're wrong, they lose points, and the other contestants will then have a chance to answer. We're going to have 10 questions in this category, each worth 100 points. So if you're ready, let's get started with card number one. Jeez, here we go. All right, here we go. Let's see what the, the points. Oh, all right. The first hint is the face on a coin flip. The face on a coin flip. All right, we're perplexed. I think we should go on to hint two. Oh, Disguise Toast has already buzzed in. Just to read it out real fast, the second hint was where golems go to cry and rattle. Toast. Sorry, Toast. It's not what you're thinking about. It's Aya Blackpaw. Easy. Of course it's Aya Blackpaw. Is it Aya Blackpaw? Uh, it is. It is. Dang. Statistics don't lie, apparently. <laughs> All right, well, let's see what the other hints were, just in case uh, you continue to be perplexed. Yeah, the other hints were Leader of the Lotus and a grill with black feet. 
face on a coin flip? flip? Uh, oh, a counterfeit uh, coin. coin. Counterfeit kind of coin. Ah, okay. Yeah. Actually, I think a girl with black feet would have probably confused me more than any of the others. <laughs> we never get to see her feet, right? I, I looked. I couldn't find pictures of her feet. How do we know it's <laughs> right? We're gonna need to do some research here. Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> we'll get uh we'll get we'll we'll get the Hearthstone wikis on it. Well, let's move on to card number two. And the hint is. And it's loaded. <laughs> I get those. Uh, it's, it's just the this, this guy's toast. toast. That's my guess. <laughs> this guy's toast. He's, <laughs> he's, my guess is that new Warlock card where you discard your hint. <laughs> oh, God. Is there a new card in this one? No. All right. Let's get that first hint up and take a look. No offense, but it prefers defending. No offense, but it prefers defending. I believe we're going to move on to the second hit. Makes for sticky situations. Hmm. All right. I think we might need a third hint before we get a buzzer. The darkest of the elementals. This is such a debate question. I, I am disappointed darkest. that there are no buzzers yet. All right. Are we, are we going to the final? Uh, oh, no, you've taken the one and three. Brian Kibler buzzed in before the fourth. There are three of them. Before Tar the Creeper? No. Is it Tar Creeper? No, it's not. Oh, oh come 100 on. points to Brian Kibler. <laughs> I was going to be really disappointed if we had to show that fourth hint. <laughs> I thought it was a one and two. Creeps no, out of the early game. Okay. Uh, Tar Lurker, Tar Lord, and Tar Creeper are the three. Tar Lord. Wait, what's the third one? Uh, Tar Lurker. Oh, yes. Mm. Lurker. I thought Lurker was going to be it. <laughs> That's the darkest. That's where experience messed you up. You overthought a little bit. Well, let's, let's move on to card number... Three. Lurkers are in the dark. That's definition. Lurkers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, creep. Like, <laughs> it's hard to argue with that. But let's see what our new hint is for our third card. Low health, I giveth large value. All right, let's move on to hint number two. The water shall protect me. The water shall protect me. All right, look, we're going on to hint number three. Have you met my friend, Baron Jackson? Anyone met my friend, Baron Jackson? Oh, oh. Brian Kibler. Uh, oh, actually, I'm going to go with, with Frostless Jaina. Is it Frostless Jaina? It is. Boom! And Kivler has pulled ahead. Question, would Jaina have been enough? Would Jaina have been enough? No, 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 Trump. No, on that one. Would Jaina Death Knight have been enough? <laughs> I'm, I'm getting worried that we would have we would have given it to you for Jaina. Is it part of this actually knowing names of things? <laughs> like, <laughs> you should be enough. embarrassed for that pick, though, Trump. If that's what, that's what <laughs> I was going to guess that, but I forgot the uh, official name. Uh, that's what happens when the when the also known as the real name, or just the name. Well, I mean, Death Knight Jane is actually the name, as <laughs> most people know her as. I'm not sure not any of you, any of that matter because Kepler buzzed in first and got right. the name right. So. Yeah, well, we'll cross that bridge when you get an uh, answer. You know, well, let's right. let let's see what the fourth and final hint would have been. I am one cool mage, and no, no, cold Jaina would not have been a correct answer. <laughs> So let's uh, let's move it on to uh, the first hint for card number five. A taunter with no taunts. Taunter with no taunts. Uh oh, uh -oh it's down an answer, and it wasn't buzz. Moving on to hint number two. A common ad in your deck. A common ad in your deck. Oh, bone bear. You're so risky, and no, you're right. That's not even. Is, is it bone mare? 
Is he right? Was it risky? It was risky, but it's also right. I mean, it's not, it's not a risk if you know it. Wow. Oh, Kibble, you are on fire. <laughs> what would be a risk is letting you figure it out. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Uh, all, right. all right. I see how it is. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, uh, let's see what the rest of the hints were. If it actually got that far, a skeletal bad dream. Good play on words there. A mount of nothing but hair and bones. You're just getting lucky right now, Kibley. <laughs> People insist on in calling it luck. <laughs> In my experience, there's no such thing as luck. All right, let's move on to number six. Our first hint for the sixth card today. I shall wear a crown. I shall wear a crown. No takers? All right. Hint number two. And drink wine from this goblet, which was buzzed in by disguised toast. Marin the Fox. Yep. Is it Marin the Fox? It is. Congratulations, Toast. Thank oh, you. God. You two mean so much more than I do. <laughs> <laughs> what gave it away? What gave it away? Your meme cards, Bone Bear uh, and Door Creeper. <laughs> <laughs> the crown was really obvious because uh, Zarok's crown. <laughs> that's what I needed to come from because there are not a lot of crowns in this game. Yeah. Oh, I, I, oh. I guess Lich King, so I'm impressed by that. I'm, I'm impressed. All right, let's see the rest of the uh, see what the rest of the hints were. While I offer a wand, if it wasn't getting obvious enough, to my <laughs> god, the golden kobold would have been your final hint. All right, let's move on to card number seven. Oh, but before we do that, I do want to let our viewers know: beware, folks. There is a minor Game of Thrones spoiler with our seventh card. Uh -oh. <laughs> and and contestants, that might be an extra hint for you. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My, 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 I, there was something crazy in my ear. S number seven is going to be the Game of Thrones spoiler, folks. That Throw sense. that out of your head for this sixth card. Let's see what our hint for our sixth card is. It's a question filled deck. A question filled deck. No takers. I want just one, one time someone to buzz in on the first one. Let's go to the second hint. A teacher of legendary status. I think we might need to move on to the third. Third hint is secrets will lead to more secrets. Disguised toast. Professor Putricide. Is it Professor Putricide? Oh. Tying it up. Toast oh, I couldn't hit the glacial up. mysteries one time. I was about to buzz that on the <laughs> <laughs> Well, what would that fourth and uh, final hint have been? PhD in decaying science. No good news. All right. I'm thinking the next one is backstab. <laughs> You're calling it ahead of time? Yeah, yeah, I haven't it's watched real. Game of Thrones yet, so I'm going to skip this question. Ah, fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> going to get on the board with this one. All right. All right. So we're moving on to card number seven, which again does contain a Game of Thrones spoiler. So let's see that first hint. A dragon with no fire. Oh, it, I, really? I, Cindergosa. Is it Cindergosa? Brian Kibler buzzed in. Yeah. Oh, I just want to point out the question. I got it instantly. And, and Brian, if you... <laughs> Wait, there are so many dragons with no fire. <laughs> no, because the Game of Thrones reference gave it away. That, that also, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, when I knew when I knew I had to give that uh, that preamble on it, being a <laughs> I told myself if Kevlar doesn't buzz in on the first hint, I'm going to have, to have him ejected from the show. Yeah, the King of dragons. <laughs> All right, what were the other hints? Not that we were ever going to get there. You can call me Doctor Freeze, breeder of champions, and a frost worm that doesn't destroy the wall. <laughs> All right, let's move it on to card number eight. The first hint is, could have come from our custom Hearthstone. Could have come from our custom Hearthstone. All right, what's the second hint? Kazakus potency times two, disguise toast. 
Look, Brian's forcing me to take these guesses. I'm not ready to guess. I'm going to go with ultimate infestation. Is it ultimate infestation? How are you doing this? Wow. <laughs> That's better than... I mean, I, I actually was about to guess the same thing. He just buzzed in first. Yeah. <laughs> against, against other uh, players, I can wait until the third hint when I'm really <laughs> secure. Against Brian, I have to do it when I'm like at eight. <laughs> Well, it's uh, Brian Kibler is officially the rope of Streamer Showdown. <laughs> Let's see what the uh, the other hints were. Talk about epic levels of value, and Blizzard makes great UIs. <laughs> <laughs> great UI design by Blizzard and Team Five. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see card number nine. Well, the hint for card number nine. This little birdie went to help friends. This little birdie went to help friends. All right, let's see hit number two. This little teddy protected his master. Let's move it to hint number three. This little piggy went to the face. Oh, 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 oh my God. <laughs> I think that was almost a tie, but Trump buzzed in first. Oh, Call of the Wild. Is it is it Call of the Wild? <laughs> I am sorry. <laughs> it is oh my god, what? Is it just Animal Companion? Oh my guesses, no. Kipler <laughs> guesses Animal Companion. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> animal Companion. <laughs> This makes no sense. Leok is not a bird. Got <laughs> oh. a bird part. He's a wyvern, right? Why? Why? Yeah, wyvern. There's no bird part. He just has wings. It's like calling a dragon a bird. <laughs> I, I I call foul, sir. <laughs> wyverns are mixed. Wyverns are mixed. I, I I think it holds up. Uh, oh, all right. Let's see what the last clue would have been. <laughs> it's always piggy. It's always piggy. It's oh, always huffer. Right. All right, that brings us to our tenth and final, our tenth and final card. Let's uh, see what that first hint is going to be. A non-standard type. Non-standard type. Okay, we're going to move to the second hint. A spell masochist Kibler. Wild pyromancer. Is it wild pyromancer? Wow. That's good. Wow. If I was not tethered to my computer via an earpiece right now, I'd be bowing. That was impressive. <laughs> I mean, the, a non-standard type, like, clearly is an allusion to wild, so it's like a wild thing, and then it's cast spells, damage itself. That's wild pyromancy. Yeah. I thought the non-standard type was a good red herring, but not good enough. <laughs> All right, let's see what the, uh, what the third and fourth hints would have been if it got that far, but... Apparently, Kibler's to be feared. Burn me once, no problem. Burn me twice, I'm dead. And Pyro and Magic do mix. There you go. All right. Well, that completes round number one. Let's let's take a look at those scores because this is not what I expected. In the lead with 600 points is Mr. Brian Kibler. Br coming up in second is Disguised Toast. Didn't think I'd be saying those words at all today. And with a negative 100 points... <laughs> <laughs> the Mayor of Value Town. Talk point. about value. <laughs> <laughs> that, I'm sorry, Trump. I just I just read the scores. <coughs> just here to read the scores. <laughs> uh, All right, let's double the points. <laughs> double the points. I'm not sure that's how the game works. <laughs> okay, so I have uh, 1,200. Toast is 800. You have negative 200. Let's double the points the next There you one. go. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. The match. It's not what you meant at all. <laughs> <laughs> well, before we move on to round two, uh, folks at watching at home, you can help us do more Hearthstone Edition showdowns by using Match Arena. Simply go to bit.ly slash showdown18 or click on the Match Arena graphic at the bottom of the description. Let's move it into round two. Round two. This round is Twitch Chat Says. In this game, we will have the players trying to guess how you, Twitch Chat, 
responded to some survey questions we asked. We surveyed each contestant's Twitch chat and got many responses. It's, however, up to the contestants to guess what your top answers are. Contestants, you will each have two lives in this game. That's what the hearts are. The game continues. Oh, sorry. Let me, uh, I, uh, a wrong answer is going to lose you one of those lives. Once you've lost two lives, you are out. The game will continue until all players have lost their hearts or until all answers are shown. The person in last place will go first and so on. The number one answer is worth, is worth 300 points. All other answers are worth 100 points. And there's going to be a total of three questions. Let's start with the first question, beginning with negative 100 points, Trump. <laughs> Hey, I get an advantage on this one. So I get to go first. Is that right? All right. So the first question is, who in the community would win a Hearthstone cosplay contest? Who do you think is on the board, Trump? Well, this one is a free 300 points for me. It's Eloise. Is Eloise on the board? You gave it away. She is, wow. but not, not the top answer. Actually, the, the lowest on the board. <laughs> All right, Toast, you're up next. Who of do you course, think? it would be Hearthstone superstar, Kraparian. Is Kraparian on the board? He is. 100 points to Toast. Oh my god, I just noticed that Trump just brought his score up to zero. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. He just reads the scores, man. He just reads the score. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure Crip has ever, has Crip ever worn a costume. No, no. <laughs> Yeah, All right, Kibler, who do you think is on the board? I mean, I'm going to have to go with uh, the imposter who's cosplaying as himself, which oh, is Disguised no. Toast. Oh, no. Show me Disguised Toast. Yes! Oh, no. oh that's oh, <laughs> 300 points to Brian Kibler. Damn. Putting you even more in the lead. So coming back around, Trump, it's your turn again. Who in the community would win a Hearthstone cosplay contest? Go with Frodan. Show me Frodan. Worth 100 points. This guy's toast. You are next. Uh, the Salty Sea Dog cosplay, Raynad. Is Raynad on the board? No. <laughs> he is not. He's not. So that's minus one heart for toast. Back to Kibler. I'm going to have to go with. The shirtless cosplay extraordinaire dog. Is dog on the board? Ooh, he's Dag not. He is not. Shirtlessness did not help. <laughs> uh, all right, Trump, who's your next guess? All right, well, you know what they say. Guess Trump and you win. So I'll guess Trump. Ooh, said Let's see if that pays off. Hey, there you, go. you always get value from Trump. All right, Toast. Who are you thinking this time? Mm, I think uh, I'm going to go with the fairest maiden in all the Hearthstone land, uh, Hafu. <laughs> Show me Hafu. Oh. Hafu is on the board. Only two left, and we go back to Brian. Uh, hmm. I'm just, I'm just going to take Trump's strategy and guess myself. Bane. All right, is Brian on the board? Oh, oh, so you should have done a toast. I mean, come on. Wow. <laughs> all right. All three of you are on the board. <laughs> Thank you, Twitch chat. Of course you guys. <laughs> Twitch chat are going to vote for you. Have to. Okay. Well, the only one I can think of remaining is the Ben Broad. Is Ben Broad on the board? He is not. Ben Broad not on the board. So everyone's down to one heart. And we bring it back around to Toast. Who's left in the community? <laughs> it's just <laughs> us three, and that's just us seven, pretty much. <laughs> There's no one else. Uh, I'm just going to go, with, even though it's 2017, I'm going to go with Forsen. Is Forsen on the board? He is not. <laughs> oh, that's all your lives, Toast. Womp womp. I am going to go sense. with uh, the cosplayer of the haha -ha emote, Tice. Is Tice on the board? He also cosplays as Kalento. Oh, there you go. Not the other way around. <laughs> <Nope>. <laughs> that is true, but that's also not the correct answer. Trump, you're, you have <laughs> the heart left. 
Uh, let's see. There's a lot of Asians on here. I'm just going to guess a Moz. <laughs> <laughs> Moz on the board. Doing his best Trump cosplay, that you're saying. <laughs> <laughs> I would have laughed so hard if Asian just popped up. <laughs> <coughs> All right. So no lives remain. What was the final name on the board? It was Tyler who has actually been cosplaying. No, I guess that's true. Yeah. Okay. He's cosplaying as Jaina. He's been cosplaying as Jaina. Yes. Yes. Uh, so, do we move on to the next question with new lives? Let's, let's load up, luckily for all of you. Two new lives for every question. All right, the next question. If you and your opponents are down to one card left in your hand slash deck and no minions on the board, what card do you want? Just going to remind you, the answers came from Twitch chat. We're starting once again. <laughs> oh, that's a big hint. Okay, well, Twitch chat, you know it, I know it, free 300 points. Show me ultimate infestation. Raw. It's not There's ultimate infestation on the board. <laughs> Oh, my not God. 300 points. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> wait. I read it completely wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you still got it. It's okay. It's just uh, not, not the 300. It was, it was second <laughs> highest. Second highest, Trump. You were real close. All right. So we're bringing it back to toast. <laughs> if there's one thing Puss Chat loves, it's the Yogg-Sarans. Mm. yogg -Saran on the board. What? Chat, what are you doing? Yeah. Yaga's still there. Brian Kibler, what card do you think Twitch Chat wants if it's the only card left? I mean, I think I think you gotta go with Reno Jackson, right? People yeah. just love that. I actually misread this and thought it said one life as well, but we're gonna go with that again because I already said it. <laughs> 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 You're an honorable winner, Brian Kibler. You're an honorable <laughs> Is Reno Jackson on the board? Oh, well. <laughs> You're breaking Reno's heart as well. Shucks. All right, back to Trump. All right, so I had this planned. Uh, we're going to get the number one answer, Jade Idol, which goes mm -hmm. with ultimate infestation. Is Jade Idol on the board? Oh my god! Okay, it well, it's on the board. Still worth points, just not 300 of them. And number one, 300 is still available this, this, in this particular question. So, Disguised Toast, do you think you know what it is? I, I probably, it's probably some meme answer. <laughs> I'm just going to go with the stable answer of Deathwing. That's is it Deathwing? Oh, oh, never mind. Uh, <laughs> Deathwing is the number one answer. The most casual 300 points I think that's been picked up so far. All right, nothing but 100 point answers left. Back to Brian Kibler. Well, this is like actually a bad card at this point because you you both only have one card, but I think Twitch chat would still say Archbishop Benedictus. Okay, did they say? Did they mention the Archbishop? You're not even close. Ooh, they did not. All right, so Kibler, Brian is out for now. All right, back to back to Trump. Show me the Trump. champion Ultrasaur. Is Ultrasaur on here? Yes. Please. Please, please show me Ultrasaur. No. What? <laughs> what? Twitch chat not playing the streamer showdown meta game. All right. Toast, you're still sitting pretty at two hearts. Four options left. Are you going to count me down? <laughs> Not yet. Okay. Soon we will, though. Think. Oh, it twists. All right. If, if you and your opponent are down to one card left in your hand slash deck and no minions on the board, what card does Twitch chat want? <coughs> uh, this is like Ryan's answer, the wrong idea, but I think Twitch chat might say it. I'm going to go with Dead Man's Hand. Did they say Dead Man's Hand? Good job. No. Chris. No. 
No, of course not. Yes, I, I did not have enough respect for Twitch chat's strategy <laughs> of wanting Yogg-Saron and Ultimate Infestation. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Trump. All right, we're going to go with Death Knight Gul'dan. Z- Blood Revil Gul'dan on the on the board for the correct name of the card. <laughs> he is. He is. So 100 points to Trump and you keep a heart back to Disguise Toast. Going with the hero strategy. Frostless Jaina. Oh, did I inspire you? Is, <laughs> is Frostless Jaina on the board? Shoot All right, got the last three hundred points. Trump, you could, you could, you could just run this board at this point if you get three right answers. Uh, show me the Lich King. Is the Lich King on the board? <laughs> I am not disappointed in our contestants. I am just dis- disappointed in Twitch chat for not voting for the Lich King. It's a sad day. Okay, what did miss? All, all the lives have been expended. What did uh, what was left on the board? This no flipper penguin. Elise like the trailblazer. trailblazer. Yesera. And mind control. <laughs> I, that I, that that was a decent, decent. I, I take issue with mind control. I love that <laughs> ultimate infestation is just the number two answer and it's total nonsense. Yeah, one card left. Like, no, no, it's because you are imagining that you have Jade Idol as the last card in your deck. Well, it, it literally says what card do you want? You have one card. <laughs> Yeah, one slash. Oh, I see. <laughs> Are you still this <laughs> like, yeah, like we finally yeah, finished yeah, the category? I just got my first yeah. <laughs> the opponent was going to play Yogg, which would have shuffled Jade Idol after treachery mm. fell, which is why you <laughs> oh. picked Station. Oh, goodness. Uh, <laughs> I answered as Twitch chat would. That's the more. The more you misunderstand the question, the better better chance you Apparently. have doing well that round, I guess. Let's uh let's move on to the third and final question for Twitch Chat says What other card character should have an alternate version? Examples being Ragnaros, Deathwing, and Elise. Hmm. I really like these rules where I go first. It, it's a good catch up. <laughs> All right. If you, well, if you keep if you keep if you if you keep owning, you're you're not gonna like the rule because you won't be first anymore. But fantastic. Anyways, we've been disappointed with this classic card for a while, and he's very iconic. Show me Illidan. Is Illidan on the board? He is. Oof. One hundred points to Trump. All right. We're gonna pass the Kibler second. Change things up. <laughs> you, you're tied. Yeah, I mean, Toast is basically first. Well, I mean, died not even first. alphabetically. He's not even alphabetically first. <laughs> but, <laughs> um, hmm. Well, I mean, what that I want to see, and if you pulled my chat, there would definitely be some dragons in there. So, hmm. let's say, hmm, let's say Anixia. Is Anixia on the board? No, no Anixia. Huh. Uh, disguised Toast. Hmm. Alternate version. Let's go with Reno Jackson. That's pretty good. Is Reno on the board? He is. What would Reno's alternate be, Toast? Uh, instead of healing, it deals damage until you're dead. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> what would you call that really well the opposite of no is yes so re yes jack <laughs> re-yes. wow regis jackson i thought you're gonna just there you, go. there you go i thought you were just gonna say shave his mustache and make him harrison jones but okay <laughs> all right we are going back around to trump i think we're gonna go with the populist vote here of patches since we see him so often God. patches on the board <laughs> Oh the yeah, pirate is. I love another patches in this game. So what would what would alternate patches be? Would you just like a different tribe? Maybe Reno Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> it would be like some sort of card that. <laughs> if you have a pirate field of full. Whenever you have a pirate heal the full, like. <laughs> mm. All right. Okay, back to uh, back to Kibler. 
Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Um, well. Well, I don't, I, yeah, I don't think people would pick the, the, the thing that came to mind that I would love to see another one, but I'm going to go with it anyway, which is Sir Finley Mergleton. Because we, we clearly need more legendary Murlocs. I would love to see more okay. Sir Finley. Let's see if he's on the board. Did, I didn't think he actually would. <laughs> Who? <laughs> that makes me sad. <laughs> All right. Disguised Toast. Well, this card is already super adorable. And we could use more adorable things. So I'm going to go with Snow Flipper. <laughs> we already have so many alternative versions of it. Well, what was your answer, Toast? Snow Flipper Penguin. Snow Flipper Penguin. A relatively new guess. No, no snow flipper. He's adorable. Okay, Trump, you are once again the healthiest player in this game with two I'm hearts. On this board, man. So maybe Toast doesn't know about Warcraft lore. That's his weak point. But Sylvanas is another major character. So let's go, Sylvanas. Ooh, I, I would not be surprised to see an alternate Sylvanas in the future, but is she on this board? She wow. is. Trump, you finally uh, picked up your right pointer. I've got no time for these games. Trump tying it up with Brian Kibler and Toast just eking a lead with 100 points. My goodness. Uh, Toast, what, what is your next guess? Well, we kind of saw him in the Grand Tournament and the Frozen Throne, and he's a classic card, so maybe they'll reuse him again. Tyrion Fordring? Is Tyrion Fordring on the board with his Ashbringer? He is. Wow. I'm trying to think, what would, would he destroy your weapon? Would he give your opponent a 5 3? No, you'll get a 3 5. They just switch the stats. Oh, you'll get a 3 5. Okay, that makes yeah. sense. <laughs> All right, back around to Trump. All right, I'm going to go with a reach here. I'm thinking that Twitch chat would be intelligent enough to go for this one. So I'm going to guess SI7 agent, also known as Disguised Toast. <laughs> Is SI7 agent on the board? No. Ooh. That's okay. You still have a heart to spare, Trump. Disguised Toast. Legendary. I can feel Legendary. the pain looking at you thinking. Legendaries, legendaries, legendaries. legendaries. Every legendary. Uh, Seem a little focused on the legendaries, gentlemen. Hey, I guess that's I seven. Every so far, it's working. Uh, Ragnaros. (laughs) (laughs) Another one. (laughs) That's a bold strategy. Let's see if it pays off. (laughs) No, no, the answer is not in the question (laughs) above. All right, Trump, you have one more chance to run the board. There are three cards left on this board. Let's go with someone even more iconic than Sylvanas, at least in Hearthstone lore, Dr. Boom. That's a good one. That is a good one. (laughs) Yep. Yes, 100 points. Although, last, you know, bottom, bottom of the pile here. Okay, so when this card came out, I was, uh, I kind of rewatched the Warcraft cinematic of please to cook you, Uther, or somewhat. So it would be very dis... Oh, I'm just rambling on. Anyways, the Lich King. Is the please Lich King on the board? Or something. He is not. Shot. Again, as an Arthas fanboy, it just disappoints the hell out of me. Well, what was left What was left dangling? What could have been picked up? Yogg yeah, oh, yeah. hmm. Saran was on the board, and Medivh the Guardian... Medivh the Guardian. I mean, technically, I mean, Medivh is an alternate version of the form of a hero you can play as. Yeah. Yeah, but that's 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 going to wrap it up for Twitch chat says. Let's let's take a look at the uh let's take a look at the points because things have wow. changed. Disguise Toast is now in the lead with only a 100 point lead. Trump the, tw- the Twitch chat whisperer. Yes. Yes. Uh Trump following just behind with 1100 and Kibler just behind Trump with 
1,000 on the dot. So you're all within a you know 100 points descending. Let's move on to round three. Round three. I'm so excited about this. All right, round three is called Who's <laughs> Capital oh, Babies. This is a <laughs> game making its debut today on this showdown. We are going to show you a picture of babies, a pair of babies that have been created by morphing the faces of two streamers, players, or personalities from the Hearthstone community. It is up to you to figure out which two people are the parents of these Kappa babies, and you must get both parents correct to get credit. You, uh, luckily, you don't lose points this round for incorrect answers. Each correct answer is worth 200 points. And contestants, <laughs> please note, if someone buzzes in before you and gets it wrong, one of those answers could still be correct because you have to get both. To and earn. I imagine if you answer incorrectly, you're locked out of answering. You will not, yeah. get, you will not get verification as to whether one of your answers was correct if the other is incorrect. And you can only guess once. Okay. All right, let's roll it with our first pair of Kappa babies. Uh, what is that <laughs> <to> me? <laughs> buzz, buzz. Oh, I can't buzz. I can't buzz. I can't buzz. Uh, buzz. Looks like we might be having some buzzer problems. Buzz, buzz, buzz. 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 No, I was <laughs> spamming left click. Buzz. <laughs> I'll refresh your browser. <laughs> no, what? This is so unfair. <laughs> he refreshed first and got the buzz in. Wait, Trump I gets it. Wrong. Oh crap. <laughs> Wait, I didn't, I've never seen them wear glasses before now I think about it. Uh, we're going to okay. go with Kriparian and Hafu though Ooh. is it Kriparian and Hafu wow alright Toast you are next I recognize those eyes anywhere I've stared in it for such a long time Ben Brode okay and the other one, I think it's Hafu oh, alright is it Ben Brode and Hafu of course it is. <laughs> Look at that lovely family photo. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm going to try not to just laugh my butt off this entire, this entire oh, round. No. All right, well, let's take a look at our second pair of Kappa babies. <laughs> Kappa, 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 Kappa. So many Kappas. Oh, look at this adorable little pair. Wow, this is pretty tough. Don't you just want to take them to Oshkosh? Ever <laughs> <laughs> here. Um, a lot of a lot of thought into the... <laughs> each. Now, I would like to remind you, each baby has different features. So not all of the features on each baby are from the same person. Try and connect eyes with mouths, noses, and such. Oh, man. Could just be a shot in the dark, man. You don't lose points, so you can buzz in with a guess. I don't want to give any information about like what I think one of them is when I have no clue what the other is. So. Yeah, I'm on the same boat. I think. <laughs> How about we trade? You tell me one of them, and I'll tell you. <laughs> you just don't know the second one. I'll uh, I'll allow it. I mean, it's like Catan. If you want to make an alliance, go for it. <laughs> we need to gang up against Toast, Kibler. So how about you tell him without me here on one of them here, and I'll give you info on the next one. <laughs> come on, Kevlar, come on. Trade oh, brick for sheep? What? Exactly. Nobody wants your sheep. <laughs> Kevlar. I, I mean, remain I... mum. All right, I'll give you a hint. I'll give you a hint. One of the one of the parents of this adorable little pair does not like wearing shirts. Well. You gotta buzz wow. in if you want to give an answer. Not Doesn't like, like wearing shirts. Wow. <laughs> but the other one, uh, here's another hint. Okay. The other, the other parent is literally a card. Yes! Yes! Right. Trump. Show me dog and 
fire vat. It's a dog and fire vat. It oh, is. Uh, I knew I, it was. I knew it was definitely dog, but I knew it was definitely fire vat. Actually, really. <laughs> I mean, I would. I was looking at this, you know, and I was certain the left baby was Raven. <laughs> yeah, kind of. I, I saw a bit of Raven in the left one. I actually yeah. was pretty certain that one of them was Pavel. <laughs> yeah, like I th yeah, I also thought about Pavel. I knew I mean, Firebat was one hundred percent on the right. <laughs> you know what they always say: a fire bat and a dog make a pobble. Well, All right, let's move on. To the, third, <laughs> the third pair of Kappa babies. Let's see what's in this egg. Oh Jesus! Oh, look at this adorable little. Look at the beautiful little flower on the headband. <laughs> Baby on the right needs to uh, shave. What a big smile that last one has. Yeah. Just happy to be in Oh, uh, I, I see you now. Oh, oh, disguised toast. Well, I know that's me. And oh, I know the other crap. one is Colento. Look at your teeth, that's right. Okay, okay so Colento and disguised toast is disguised toasted's anter. It is. <laughs> Good eye, Toast. I mean, the right baby just looks like Tyler. Like, <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> did you, Toast? Did you know your son is Tyler? <laughs> I, I, I mean, you know, I had no idea, but he might, he might be my dad or something. <laughs> my <favorite I'm> just <laughs> This isn't fair using a picture of a contestant. Do you think I spend a lot of time looking at myself? You know, it's actually a disadvantage. <laughs> oh, we know, we know you look at yourself in the morning. Come on. All right, let's move on to the fourth pair of Kappa babies. Yeah. So glad we're doing eight of these. <laughs> oh, yes. Well, 16 babies. Oh, my Lord. Oh. <laughs> Oh, these are these these babies are models. This is unfair. That's smart. Shiro doesn't like this one. No, Sh Shiro's upset. Yeah. Hmm. Wow. Disguised toast buzzing in again. Those droopy eyes has to be Raynads, and those big beautiful blues must be Ali Strazas, right? Is it oh, Raynad and wow. Ali Straza? Did the eyes give it away? Oh my I god! I actually knew. Yeah, I knew what, oh, that it was Ali. I didn't. I didn't actually get rain at from that. But <laughs> out of the park, toast. Well called. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Ali was easy because her eyes are like really intense. I think this Rain's is the least, the hard. least terrifying family photo we've seen so far. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's uh, let's let's see our fifth pair. I really want one of these eggs to be a baby raptor. What the? <laughs> Chan man, you're breaking the host. Uh, oh, that God, that left baby is just so pleased with himself. <laughs> Any? Any, any guesses? Huh? Oh, multiple buzzes, but the first one goes to Toast. First guess. I think Strive Pro for sure. The second one's really hard, but I'm going to guess Raven. Is it Strife Pro and Raven? Oh, no, it is not. It is not. Brian Kibler. No lost points, though. You don't I, I, like, Strife Crow's the one that I, I can tell for sure. <laughs> I, I'm going to go with Strife Crow and Crip. Is it Strife Crow and Crip? And a fish. Okay. It is not. Good guess, though. Cool. Trump. I'll, uh, I'll take a hint, Garrett. <laughs> <laughs> You'll take oh, a hint? Of course, this way. I'm not, I'm not sure I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> I'll give you a hint. It's not Putin. <laughs> that was my next guess. <laughs> Uh, well, let's see. I, he's he's a streamer. 
And uh, also, Trump, could you please buzz in for us? If okay. Well, of uh, man, Strife Crow and Kaleno. Is it Strife? Is it Strife Crow and Kalento? It's not. It's not Hitler. It, it is not. Who were the parents of these Kappa babies? Oh, Savitz. You're looking for Savitz. Oh. And I, I sympathize here. Savitz is uh, majestic hair <laughs> being out yeah, of the world. I expected that smell to be a uh, Strife Cruz. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we shouldn't say Masan. <laughs> yeah, I mean, All nice right, let's time. see our sixth pair of Kappa babies. Uh, here we go. I really just wanted to go Kappa, 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 Kappa as all those little heads are going in. That's a I, class, uh, it should be really obvious, but... I can't cover up their face. This is not my category. <laughs> yeah. I'll give you all a hint before you buzz in. The glasses don't have to match the eyes. Oh, oh, they're they're so fashionable. They're such fashionable babies. Who could their parents be? Do you, do you any guesses on on one of them, or are you trying to figure out both? Are you are you both There's stumped one, or just one. single? Second one's hard. I've stared in the eyes of one of them for a long time. I haven't <laughs> seen the second one that often. Oh, okay. Let's trade info. I'll uh, toast. <laughs> <clears throat> Are we forming another alliance? Only this time with between. Yeah, I don't think that women? makes sense. <laughs> 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 Seems like a bad strategy. Is it Twitch chat's uh, nailing this, by the way. Uh, I'm going to take a guess. Not that you're allowed to look. <laughs> if Let you're going to take, well, take a guess, you gotta, you got to buzz in. There are rules, you see. I'm, I'm just, I'm loving Toast's etiquette of when he's thinking really hard. Mike gets out of the way. He leans out of frame. Yeah. Got a real, real streamer showdown poker face going. Eyes are really big on the left. Whose eyes are those? <sighs> okay, here's a hint. Uh, could be mistaken for a martial artist. Yes, yes. Trump, Trump buzzed Jackie in Chan first. And Frodan. Sorry. Damn it. Repeat that. Jackie Chan and Frodan. All right. Is it Jackie Chan and Frodan? It is. <laughs> Throwdown was easy. Yeah, I don't look yeah, at Jackie yeah. Chan that often. And glasses, uh, glasses can really throw you. Really throw you. Well, grats, Trump. Hmm. All right, that's a lovely family photo. But let's move on to our seventh pair of Kappa babies. What's going to hatch out of this one? I just can't stop laughing with this one. <laughs> the one on the uh, left looks like it has a comb over. <laughs> one's always easy, the other one's the hard one. Wait, you have one? I don't have anything. <laughs> Toast, I'm not sure you should be, really should be giving easy. out what you think the answer is. Huh. I mean, right, baby is just so serious. One really easy because they're on the show. Toast. Ah. <laughs> uh, all right. I could just wait for the head. Trump, Trump, you're you're looking or uh, toast. You look like you wanna you wanna say something. The microphone is back. I want to guess, but I also want to wait for the hint to confirm it. <laughs> Are we allowed to give a hint yet? Well, 
Well, no guts, no glory. All right, disguise toast. What do you think? Raven and Thice. Is it Raven and Tice? All right, I'll give you a hint. One of those was yeah. correct. Yeah. That didn't help. Well, actually, it did help. Well, no, because I could tell from Toast uh, which one he was more confident in. So. Well, just because Toast was confident doesn't doesn't mean his, his confident pick was, was correct. Hmm. Oh, Brian is it, Kibler. Is it me and Tice? Is it Brian Kibler and Tice? It <laughs> Wow. I can see my teeth right there. Those are my teeth. So. Oh. <laughs> I was looking at I got one. Kibler for the longest time. It had to be me no. in it, but I got one. No? <laughs> uh, you know, I was wondering what it would look like with hair loss. All right, let's move on to our final pair of Kappa babies. Yep. Are you gentlemen ready? It's going to be it. What could possibly hatch from that egg? No, oh, Jesus. Oh, no, wait, I wasn't on the Kappa Baby show. Come on. <laughs> These babies already have sponsors. <laughs> That's not fair at all. <laughs> Would have been too easy if you were on here, Trump. This one's easy. Okay, Disguise Toast. The two biggest Twist Chat monstrosities, Eloise and Forsen. Is it Eloise and Forsen? Oh, wow. It is. I was the most. Them. Eloise, I could definitely tell. Forsen got, got a bit of that mustache and uh, panda eyes. And, and he's dead behind the eyes? Yeah. yeah. I suppose that's fair. <laughs> <laughs> that's brutal. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, let's. Let's take a look at the scores because that, that, that concludes that round. Disguise Toast, you are winning with 2,000 points. Trump, you are still in second place with 1,500 points. And Brian Kibler, you are you are in Can I go back to card trivia? Let's do that again. <laughs> <laughs> All right. A uh, quick reminder, folks, that if you want more Hearthstone uh, showdowns, you can support today's show by using Matcharino. Simply go to bit.ly slash showdown18 or click on the Macharino graphic at the bottom of the description and, uh, and support today's stream. And uh, we have a, a donor we want to thank today. Thank you to Killer Monk for the donation of $30. Thank you very much. Just check, go on over to bit.ly slash showdown18. And also, Jambon Rose for donating $144. Wow, thank you so much. That's great. Thank, thank you. you. Now, it is time to start round four. Round four. My favorite title of today, Art Stone. In this game, each of you are going to take turns drawing while the other two players are going to be guessing. Each artist will be drawing a new card. If the answer is guessed correctly, then the artist and the correct guesser both receive 300 points each. If nobody guesses correctly, no one gets points. Each player will draw a total of two cards today. Uh, guessers, you're going to have to buzz in before you guess, just like the previous round, uh, and you each get only one guess uh, per drawing. Uh, artists, take note, you are not allowed to use numbers, letters, or basic symbols like an at symbol or a question mark. Uh, if, if one of the artists does use a band symbol, you will be penalized by not receiving any points that round while the correct guesser will receive the points. I'm not going to stop Ooh. you. I'll let you finish. And the guessers can still buzz in. Right answers are going to be over 300 points apiece. You will not be penalized for wrong guesses. And the, uh, we'll be starting with Disguised Toast drawing. So I wonder if the correct strategy is for us just, us just to just not guess on Toast's thing so you can't get points. But, Ooh. But, I mean, you could just let the timer roll, run out. That's a good I mean, idea. I'll just stay. Right. Just show your hands, and I'm game. There you go. <laughs> you just put your hands up. <laughs> Let's go. And just and just so you know, uh, plus minus and arrows are allowed. Those are allowed, even though they are technically on a keyboard. <laughs> plus minus arrows, totally okay to draw. Is this legal? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, right. 
this guy's toast are you ready yeah all first right, it was a strategy game let's so. start that timer and see what this guy's toast has to uh has to show us gotta warm up those warm up those digital pencils Wait, has it started yet? I'm not seeing anything yet. <sighs> Just give it one second. Giving you some time to really think on a toast. I feel really lucky this round, by the way, because I... I went to art school, so if I had to compete in this, I'd be losing my mind having to draw with a mouse. <laughs> Does anyone try harding today? Did you bring a tablet with you? Oh, God. You yeah. could have borrowed lilies. <laughs> mm, I'm at the page with the scores and buzzing and buzzes and timer. There's no board on my screen yet. Okay. We're just, we're just doing a refresh. You guys aren't actually not going to guess, right? That's, that's a joke. You got, I mean, whoever guesses it will get points. So it's in your individual best interest to guess correctly. Well, it depends what your goal is, right? This like, is like the, the prisoner's goal... dilemma here. So right. if we both cooperate, it's actually best for both of us. Right. But if one of you co uh, don't cooperate and you guess correctly, you are in a better position. Well, it's, it's, it's actually not even, not even necessarily true, right? Because it only benefits you relative to the other player. If the goal is to win, it's actually probably in both of our best interest not to guess, period, because you getting more points doesn't actually improve our standing relative to you. You know, Kibler, if you're actually serious here, I am serious. <laughs> I, mean, I will not vote. I will not <laughs> guess. Are you game for that? I mean, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I wouldn't have brought it up if I wasn't. Okay. I'm so gonna, we don't even bother to draw. We're not going to guess. I'm going to believe in you, Kibler. <laughs> we are uh, forming an alliance here. All right. Okay. Well, we're going to have to take a quick break. So we'll get back to your, your scheming and metagaming briefly. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone, to the Hearthstone edition of Streamer Showdown. Uh, sadly, the servers that we use for the game show are down, and this is the equivalent... Right uh, having our internet go down midstream. So we'll be shortening today's game to four rounds, which means this next round is our final round. Dun, so dun, dun. <laughs> I would like to point wow. out we, we're skipping the memory one, and that's usually when I get 80% of the points. So. Oh, I, oh, I mean, it's, it's definitely like, rigged. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I'll also mention, though, that Kipler and I were going to follow through on the art plan. <laughs> I know. If, if there's one thing I'm the saddest about, it's that uh, Brian Kibler and Trump will not get to conspire against Toast uh, in a round of drawing. But uh, let's get started. This final round. Oh, not quite yet. A few more oh, minutes. We actually cannot start yet. That's quite all right. You when can just tell that. You know, we're, we're trying to finish with a... Uh, you know, we're just trying to finish the show the best that we can because yeah, we didn't leave it like a, like ended early or anything. You know, we're or trying ended. to fin finish the show as best as we can, which, uh, which means we're going to be doing some things manually. So, I like to think of it as old school. This is some old school streamery. Okay, I, I'm getting word that we get to start our final round, which is going to be Emoji G. And if you are unfamiliar with Emoji G, this is the game where we show you a series of emojis and clip art. And that those series of emojis and clip art will describe a popular Hearthstone voice line. And you, the contestants, would typically ring in, but today you'll be clapping to, <laughs> to see who gets to answer the question. Your questions will be worth 300 points. You will not lose points for a wrong answer. So let's see if we can see our first Emoji G. All right. Contestants, can you see the emoji G? Yep, I see it. Ooh, I actually... Uh, I know this one, but I don't know it, unfortunately. You know this one, but you don't know I, it? I know what it says, but I don't know what it is. 
Uh, well, you, the, you're supposed to guess the voice line. Oh, you just so, guess the words. Just guess well, the words. No, okay. buzz, it buzz. has to be a voice line from buzz. a park. <laughs> All right, Trump. What okay. do you think the voice line is? Where shall I strike? Is it where shall I strike? <laughs> it is. It is where shall I strike. They're what? Ding, What's ding, that ding, from? Ding. Where shall I strike? But what card is that? Uh, I don't know. I'm trying to... I... It's Druid of the Claw. Oh, uh, great. Right. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. I was, like, I was like stuck on pin for that first one. I was like, <laughs> you drop the pin, and then... I don't know. <laughs> well, Trump, you, you got it. You got it. Let's see if we... Uh, let Let's see what the next emoji G is. Here's the next emoji G. Me. Oh, oh. <laughs> I was worried I was going to have to guess who clap <laughs> first, but no, it's just Trump again. For the war chief. Is it for the war chief? Ding, ding, ding. It, <laughs> is. it is for the war chief. Well, how, what's the middle thing? The war chief. It's not oh. peace, it's war. For... Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, let's take a look at the next emoji G. It's baking. There it is. What is that last one? Got some more eyes. Really thinking about this. <laughs> there's some there's some lightning going on. There's an M. <laughs> <laughs> we need uh, help with the last one. You need yeah, help with the last one. Can we, can we give a hint on the last one? I think we understand the M. <laughs> uh, like there's, okay. there's, there's, there's a vehicle. Uh, maybe think of other words for vehicle. Uh, the, the, so the last three images that are kind of stacked in a triangle formation yeah. they make one. Oh, three images! I got it. I got it. Okay, Trump, what do you think this is? I am power incarnate! <laughs> Ding. Okay. And I, would, I, I don't think in I have this power. Car, well, incarnate. incarnate. It's a net? It's a net. Oh, it looks like a flower to me. <laughs> like the resolution I'm seeing it at. I'm like, I'm a car rose. What? What? <laughs> All right, all right. Well, I don't have the power to give Trump extra points just for his delivery, but if I could, I would. <laughs> that was that was great. You're, just, you're, you're inspiring me, Trump. All right, so we're going to be moving on to the next emoji G. I see Toast is just poised and ready to start clapping. Oh. oh, 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 all right, toast. Pay attention, class. Is it? it it's, it's clearly pay attention, class. Mm. Yes, it is. So, points to toast. Violet teacher, well done, toast. Thank you. <laughs> rapidly, rapidly burning through the emoji G's. You're so much better at this than, uh, than Kappa babies. <laughs> I mean, these, it's easy. You just read what's on the board. <laughs> I can read. Let's see if the next one's as easy. It may not be. Yes. <laughs> Was yes your answer? I oh, realized yeah. suddenly that this is actually... Um, 
Oh, he's stalling for go time. For it, go for it, uh, Trump, Trump has already buzzed in, so Toast will oh. go second if Trump gets it wrong. Okay, so I forgot that this wasn't StarCraft for a moment. I, 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 oh. I was like, <laughs> okay, my shield for Argus. That is so not cool. He had like a home. That <laughs> <laughs> I was going to guess that. my shield for ire for a moment, but then I realized. For ire. That's not even, it's my life for ire. Yeah, I was going to say, that's even a voice line from exactly. StarCraft. Like... Right, rep, I, I'm going to need you to step in here. With all that, all like I saw there. <laughs> Producers, if you're hearing this, please make the next MOGG the number uh, the number six and a picture of a pool, please. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'd appreciate it. All right, you were correct, by the way, Trump. Uh, despite disguised toasts, fantastic. Uh, let's, let's see the next emoji. G. Okay. Uh, oh, Kibler with the clap. I think that's to Northrend. Is this to Northrend? It is. It yeah. is to Northrend. Your Star Wars powers helped you. How'd, how'd you get it so darn fast, Kibler? What's well, it's mostly to North, and I'm like, the only thing is Northrend. And I'm like, I guess that's Kylo Ren's helmet, too. So I sort of figured out after the fact that I'd already like, <laughs> determined what I was going to say. It's a bold strategy. Good. Fast thinking. Fast thinking. I like it. Hmm. All right. Second to last emoji G coming up. Ooh. It's getting scary, gents. Oh, there's some bones going on here. Was that toast? Yes. Toast. Okay, I couldn't see you clapping actually in frame. What do you think it is, toast? Join or die. Oh. Oh. Nice. It is, is it join or die or both? And of course it is. It is join or die or both. Congratulations, Toast. That was a good one. That was a good one. Kibler, I'm going to need you to step it up on this last one. <laughs> <laughs> Me? Yes. Get this next one, Kibler. I'm having I'm having trouble reading the scores or I would recant it. <laughs> yeah, I don't even I don't even know what the scores are. I can't really tell. <laughs> Thank you, muffins. Oh, they can't hear me. Oh no, I thought they could hear you. Uh, well, now I know that toast is twenty six hundred, Trump is twenty seven hundred, and <laughs> I have basically nothing. So um, I'm going to need you to get this next one, to uh, Kibler. If we could type scores in the chat somewhere, that'd be great. So, all right, final emoji G. <sighs> And somebody's happy about light bulbs. Oh, toast, no! toast clapped. What's your guess? Uh, light smiles upon the just. Light smiles <laughs> upon the just. Oh my God, you did it! Is it? Oh my god! So yeah, that's it. It is! Toast! <sighs> oh! Toast comes back with a victory at the last, last possible question. Toast <laughs> undefeated! <laughs> my goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> Toast, you, you're oh my god. <laughs> party, man. It's time to party. Uh. <laughs> that, so Disguise Toast is your winner, Twitch chat. So spam PogChamp in his honor. Spam it. <laughs> I thought I was actually going to get to host the first streamer showdown where, where Toast didn't win. Oh, my God. I can't and believe it. he had to get two straight there at the end. I, I still don't know what the last thing represents. It was up on, and then it was just do it. The uh, Nike, the 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 was part of the yes. three word slogan for Nike. Like the part I, got, I actually like, had a lot of trouble telling what some of the, the emojis were. Like, I'm trying to like stare at the screen. And I'm like, I couldn't even like see you know, what they're supposed to be. 
Oh yeah, it was tough to use. <laughs> well, you, you, I mean, normally it wouldn't be like this. I think all three of you did a great job. <laughs> we, uh, we were still able to, we were still able to close out the show, and all three of you adapted. I think beautifully uh, after the server went down. So I'm going to use being colorblind as an excuse because I couldn't, you know, identify the emojis by just their, their shape and colors. Uh, also okay. that not everything was just questions about cards. Cause I know those. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, cards say things. Yeah. They don't say them in emojis, but they say them. <laughs> Trump, do you, uh, do you have uh, any, any words? You, I mean, uh, Brian Kibler's rolling out, rolling out the excuses you you've lost for the third time um man i'm getting closer and closer i guess next time when i meet you when you're still on the show toast i will defeat you yeah trump made it real close that was very uh <laughs> it's like hero's graveyard very <laughs> you got me this time but it's all right that's just payback for last time Trump, I have one question for you. Do you think that if your face were on any of the Kappa babies, that that would have given you the, the edge? <laughs> that would have been the difference. That's right. It was rigged against me <laughs> from the beginning. How can you show two of the contestants, but not mine? I don't, I don't even... <laughs> like, I didn't recognize guys. Kibler's smile. I knew that it was Thice. <laughs> All right, in Brian's Thice. defense, it took him like a good five minutes to recognize his own... Well, no, I, I knew it was me. I just didn't know the other person. Oh, I was like wow. staring at the other person like, who is this? And then he guessed Raven and Tice, and I was like, oh, okay, that, yeah, that, that makes sense. That's Tice. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Well, congratulations, Toast. How does it feel to just be the, the uh, reigning no. win streak champion? It's, it's very, very stressful. <laughs> <laughs> stressful, that's the, what? Are you just, you're already worried about the next streamer showdown? But uh, both my opponents today has been... Uh, the toughest competition I've ever had. I think winning by, I've tied before, but like this is the closest win margin I've ever had. I mean, that's that's a high accolade. Do you, you think Brian Kibler and Trump were tougher than Ben Brode? Uh... You know, to be fair, we didn't have the meme section this time, and I'm fairly convinced that Toast would have racked up the points on that one, mm. at least over me. Maybe Kibler would have done well, but who knows? How many segments did we not do? Like two? Two. Two. Art. two. So one would have been a test of your art skills, and the other would That's have been right. a test. If we had the art the skill one, though, uh, Toast would have lost some points on that. Yeah. <laughs> because he's a bad artist or because you and Brian were conspiring against him? Well, he's certainly going to get points from drawing, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cruel. Well, uh, gentlemen, again, thank you so much for, for adapting here at the uh, 11th hour of the Hearthstone edition of Streamer Showdown. Uh, let's go around uh, around the table. Everyone, uh, let's find out where folks can find you when, when you're not being beaten by Toast uh, or you're winning as Toast. Uh, Disguise Toast, where can everyone find you? You can find <laughs> me on uh, this channel called twitch.tv slash Disguise Toast. I, I, I believe it's the one everyone's on right now. And of course, I will be revealing my brand new cards right after. Cards? This, uh, ends. Cards. Ooh, what? Wow. Blizzard favoritism. That's where the card, the one card went for any card reveal ever for my podcast. <laughs> I got oh it. my God. <laughs> also, Disguise does, I, I love you, man, but I'm pretty sure that's an HS on the end of your twitch.tv URL. All right. Someone took my main one. <laughs> All right. Brian Kibler, how about you? Uh, you can find me on Twitch TV slash BM Kibler and on my uh, unbanned, or at least not banned, YouTube <laughs> of YouTube.com slash BM Kibler. <laughs> and I'm not an imposter of myself, unlike some people. Really emphasizing I'm the sure. BM in his outro. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Trump, how about yourself? You can find me on twitch.tv slash trumpsc or youtube.com slash trumpsc. I'm actually going to be reviewing Toast cards right after he <laughs> reveals them. So we'll see what I think of those cards. Nice, nice. I think you should also just review the way he revealed them. You know, his oh, given style. One on. star for that reveal. I'll be uh, intently watching. I guarantee you there's <laughs> at least two five-star cards. Oh, uh, well, awesome. Really, Toast, really. Okay. At least Call two. 
<laughs> You're revealing more than two. <laughs> well, I mean, it could be two exactly. It could be two. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Would it be something like uh, Call of the Wild, where that's like three cards, where you're getting... By the way, that was rigged! Oh my god, if I got that one, <laughs> I would have won! <laughs> no. Anyways, that's cool, man. <laughs> Best of luck with all of that, gentlemen. Uh, folks, if you want to follow me on Twitter, I'm at Garrett Art, two R's, two T's, and Garrett. All of the podcasts that I do, including the Hearthstone one called The Angry Chicken, can be found wherever podcasts are or at amove.tv. We have to thank Chan Man V and Muffins for producing today and bringing the show to the Hearthstone community, especially today. They, I, they did such a great job recovering from just a, an awful server going down. Uh, also, a shout out to Moto for helping write the questions today. Thanks to Matcharino for sponsoring the tip jar and everyone that has donated so far. There are streamer showdowns for many different games and communities, folks. If you like the show, check out other streamer showdowns as well. They do things like League of Legends, Overwatch, and Variety Gaming. So follow the show on Twitter at Stream Showdown to find out when the next show is going to be. And VODs will be up soon over at YouTube.com slash Chan So stay tuned for the next broadcast. Good luck and have fun, everyone. <laughs>